I hope you are doing well. Welcome to our channel. For those of you who don't know us, my name is Mariana and my husband who is behind the camera is Rodrigo. We start a homestead from scratch here in Brazil and we are going to show you everything to you. Most of the things we have already started, which is our house, we have started the, the fruit trees, planting, we start our organic garden. And we are doing a lot of things in our videos and we are showing everything. And today I want to show you the results from the past videos where we made this soil. That is a really important thing because here it rains a lot. In the past few weeks, I think it rained every other day, so a lot of rain. And we needed to do this because the rain was going to the house, inside the house, so we did this. And Overall, it's working really well. There are some points that we can improve because at some points you can see that the water is stopped here, here as well, and also here. But overall, it's working because the water, when, when falls, the water goes straight to that direction, which, is, which was our goal. The water comes here. And all the way, all the way to the front of the house. So that was our goal. You can see here, the water goes on that direction. So it's working, it's working really well. And if it rains here today or tomorrow, I can show you in action. But that's, that's it. And today we are going to do something inside the house. We are going to start the plastering putty on the, in the bathroom. We already finished in the living room and in the kitchen. So we are very excited to be moving forward. This one more step. So I hope you enjoyed today's video and stay there with us. And today, as you can see, it's sunny, different than the other days. But the weather forecast is that today it may rain, it's like 40% of chance. And you can see here that the area is clean. I finally was able to clean this all, so I'm very happy for that. And Rodrigo is already inside the house. The plaster in putty is already done, it's here. And today, oh let me, let me show you the, the results from the living room and the kitchen. So here is our kitchen. Good morning, my friends. <laughs> so here, it's everything's already finished. This part and this part. So it looks looks really good. And today we are going to start working in the bathroom. Let me show you. So our goal for today is to finish applying the plaster in putty in this part here and you can see that this part of the wall is still open but Rodrigo will come here in the during the week maybe on Wednesday or Thursday I don't know he, he's going to come here and start um, laying the other concrete blocks to close this wall and also this part here. And after that, he will also apply the putty to the, to the remaining part. And so today our goal is to finish this wall and also this wall here. I believe that in this wall will be a little difficult because in this upper part, the it will be necessary to apply a lot of putty, like a lot, like four to five centimeters. So you'll be, you'll be difficult. Can you see that? This thing here is what we use to measure how much putty we are going to have to apply. And in this part here, you can see that the, the putty will be very thin. It, this is because this wall was was built up a little bit bent not, not 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 like this but kind of it's not you cannot see uh, very well just with bare eyes but it's there there is a difference and we are going to correct this by applying the putty 
So that's it. I hope you enjoy and stay there. It's already 2 p.m. and we have made a lot of progress today. You can see this wall here. Rodrigo has already finished applying the putty. And this part down here was already finished the last week. And this wall here, Rodrigo already made half of it. You can see he applied the, the putty. And he's waiting for the wall to dry a bit and then he's going to remove the exceeding putty and what what will be left he will use to apply to this part here this upper part we still have a lot of work to do but we are making good progress As you can see, it's still early, we still have some daylight and we have already taken our shower, we are already preparing our dinner, Rodrigo is there cutting the, the wood for the fire. Oh, nice. <laughs> and today I want to show you something really special to us. It's our next step here, that will be our energy and here we have the power poles that we are going to use. I don't know if where you live um, in the in the countryside people use this, but here it's very common. This is this is uh, eucalyptus um, power pole that we are going to use, and here we have ten, but two of them is going to be for for the fence. And let me show you a little bit closer. They are very 
they are this big this large I mean and we are going to install in our street and this will be I think in the next few weeks we are going to start installing the energy this is a really important step for us because without energy there are a lot of things that we cannot do here especially inside the house we want to work late at night and we don't have light it's really really terrible and with the light you'll be very good for us you'll be a very uh, large step we are going to take and we are very excited about it and now I'm going to go up there and show you our dinner It's already dark and we are about to eat but first I wanted to show you the last acquisition we had here so this is a, uh, a spotlight it's very strong and it has some functionalities one is a strong light the other is a not so strong light and then we have this light at the bottom that we can use like this we hung in the in the ceiling and it, it is lighting up all the all this area so we really enjoyed and here let me show you what we prepared here we have some pasta delicious. and in, yes it's very delicious this pasta we have corn peas olives good. very good guys and we are so hungry now you can see the it's not very good looking because we overcooked it the the fire was too high and and it ended in the it ended up like this but this the the taste it's what matters for us salad oh i forgot tomato. the salad or tomato salad we have some onions as well and we put some salt some oil and and lemon lime actually this this is small one and there we have our meat and some sausage this is a chicken sausage it is very good it's almost ready and we are about to eat we are so hungry
it's a new day here and today we just want to show you the final results from yesterday. It was a very productive day. Let's show you. Here is our spotlight because it's not very um, light in here today because it's cloudy. But let's see, so we, f we finished this part here this part of the wall and this one you can see that this part here is not very smooth this is because on this part we are going to apply the tiles the tiles will be on this part on this wall and on this wall because here will be the shower and in the rest of the bathroom we are just going to paint maybe in the future we will apply tile too but for now we are going to apply tiles only on this part and here, in the upper part, you can see that we applied the, the putty very roughly because we are going to finish this part of the wall other day. But that's it. I think we did a very good job and we are advancing a lot. And here also, let me show you this wall here. I was forgetting already. We also finished this part of the wall. You can see that on the top, on the top, we are missing two layers of concrete blocks. But during the week, Rodrigo, Rodrigo will come here and finalize these two. So that's it, guys. I hope you enjoyed. We made a lot of progress in this bathroom. And hopefully on the next video, we will finish almost everything. So see you on the next video.